All right, so here's how you can use an encoder um, to drive other software. So I'm going to demo this with the um, the PicoScope uh, software, which I, people sometimes say that they like having real knobs. Um, so here's an easy way to fix that. So I have a digital encoder connected to a um, USB dev board. And as I change the encoder, oops, I have to have the scope software has to get control there. Um, as I change the encoder, what you'll see is the the time scale is changing there. So it's just like a real, real regular scope. Um, and this is super easy to do. You can buy a uh, this USB board is thirty dollars. Even better would be the Teensy board, which is I think like twenty four or twenty five dollars. And you just would have to add a number of encoders. I only have the one encoder. Uh, right now and this just gets mapped to keyboard commands. So for example as I move the encoder right now I have it set up to A and B uh, and then I just change that in the PicoScope software to do whatever I want. In this case I'm ch changing the time scale um, but obviously you can map this to anything else. So I'm gonna get a bunch more encoders to test this out so you and set up a little box with um, with all of them in there. You have a little physical peripheral for controlling the scope.